Alright, yo, what's up guys? Red Wreck here, bringing you guys a World War II video for today. I have not made a World War II video in a minute, guys. It's been, actually been a minute. I've been doing a lot of multi-cod, a lot of MW2, a lot of MW3, even some ghosts here and there, but I haven't done a World War II video in quite a while, which is kind of ironic because I actually joined Red off of this game. I won the Red RC off of hitting World War II trick shot, so it would make sense that I'd be playing this game more, but I'm not going to lie. I've just been having fun making a lot of multi cod videos. You guys have really seemed to be enjoying them, especially the uncut MW2 R attack that I made uh, like three days ago. It's doing crazy. The feedback is insane. Everyone's loving that video, so I can't wait to make another one. I might even hop on MW2 tonight and try to make another MW2. W2 Artec. That'd be pretty cool if I can do that and get that done. Je Jesus. She okay? <laughs> Anyways, I typically make these videos like SND videos with like the whole party and we're all just doing like live trick shotting highlights and hidden shots and stuff like that because I know the title has like 11 shots or something because I've actually been playing this game a lot with my boy Kenshi the past couple of days and we've been hitting bangers mostly him he will be linked in the description because he has like the majority of the shots that I'm going to show you guys in this video but yeah I've been playing this game a lot more recently just because it's actually fun just playing with the homies you know it's it's like a pretty good game it's just no one even plays anymore and that's kind of what i want to talk about a little bit is i know kiwi's actually made a video talking about black ops 4 and you know call of duty trick shotting yada 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 all that good stuff and i just kind of want to put my two cents into like how i feel about the you know the new cod and how trick shotting and everything well yeah like you get the point okay but first let me hit this cross map trick shot Ooh, imagine uh hello everyone just timing out now when i'm the game that i decide to make the video everyone just timing out that's that that's perfect yeah you know That'd be so, oh my god, imagine hitting the reverse wall being to, like, oh, that'd be sick. But anyways, guys, Black Ops 4 was actually announced, and as you guys know, I'm actually pretty excited about it. I made a couple of tweets talking about it. I know that Black Ops, like, as a series, when you think about it, has never made a bad Call of Duty. Think about it like this, Black Ops 1, innovative for Call of Duty, a lot of giant YouTubers and really successful people got their start playing Black Ops 1, and even right now, that game still has, like, over a hundred thousand concurrent players sometimes like that is that is ridiculous for a game that old you know you don't see that a lot with games so black ops 1 is still popping after so many years and now obviously we all know black ops 2 was you know definitely one of the best cods ever released other than like mw2 or mw3 i know i know I, mw3 doesn't fall into that category but for me it does because i just love that game so much but yeah black ops 2 we all know that was like one of the greatest cods to ever come out black ops 3 even Kiwi said it. He didn't like it as much. You know, it wasn't really for him. But you have to admit, the Black Ops 3 community was one of the strongest communities and still is, like, a really strong community. Like, you know what COD is successful when you have, like, multiple people that are able to, like, grow and benefit and, like, blow up, quote-unquote, because of that Call of Duty. For example, when you look at games like Infinite Warfare... You know, even AW or even World War II, this game right here. Not, there's no YouTubers that were able to like blow up off of these Call of Duties. When you look at games like Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3, even back in the days on Black Ops 1, you have YouTubers that were literally blowing up their channel and completely changing their whole life just because of a single Call of Duty, as crazy as that sounds. You don't get that with like IW or, the, or World War II. But you got that on Black Ops 3, you know, when you look at it on a large scale, Black Ops 3, you had people like Incredilag and Scissors and all these people that were like popping off of Black Ops 3. Same thing with uh, people like Fearless and all these other guys. Everyone just like blew up off of Black Ops 3 if you were good at it and were making pretty good content. That's because they had a really strong community. Black Ops 2, I don't even gotta say. The whole Red House exploded off Black Ops 2. So many other YouTubers, Fearless, all these other guys also blew up off of Black Ops 2. It was just such a good game for growth because the community was really strong. Same thing goes with Black Ops 1, and you guys get the point. There hasn't been a bad Call of Duty game as far as the community and growth is concerned. You know, all the Black Ops games that came out were good in that set. Oh, I'm dead. Okay. 
I guess he didn't like what I was talking about. He's not a Black Ops fan. But guys, I'm not just going to sit here and talk about how like, oh, this is going to be the COD that saves the COD community because I know everybody is sick and tired of people saying that every year. We've been saying it since Advanced Warfare, all right, guys? Everybody knows that that's just the trend. That's just how it goes. You, you know, the game comes out. Everybody buys it. Even if you say you're not going to buy it, everybody buys it. They play it. They're like, yeah, it's a... And then it dies out. Like, oh, and then they start saying COD is dead and then, you you know eight months later they get hyped about the new cod and they get the new cod even though cod is dead and then the community is revived for like two months and then back on the side it's just a cycle that's just a, that's how the cod community goes unless we get a really really good game for example black ops 3 you know everyone kind of left that game but for the people that really enjoyed it it was the time of their life the community was amazing and everything like that for snipers and trick shooters as well that's just like the last good cod we had is black ops 3 as kiwis even mentioned so i really hope that like black ops 4 you know Troyarch knows what they're doing so i hope black ops 4 is just as good i do know that like a big thing especially with a game like world war 2 is like the colors and everything like that i love the trick shot mechanics on world war 2 you know you can instant swap you can't yy which i really wish you can do on black ops 4 i feel like yy just make trick shots look so much cooler because you can like you know you can do fade shots you can do glides and all this other cool stuff that you can't really do without yy's but yeah, i mean look at all the other downsides you know you can insta swap but you couldn't insta swap on mw2 and it's still one of the greatest games of all time you know what i mean i don't know where i'm going with this video but anyways i was saying something about the colors i do know that like with Troyer games black ops 2 black ops 3 they have it down with their colors that's the, one of the reasons why like everyone just loves fortnite it just looks like a really good game i love world war 2 but i'm not gonna lie I can't play it for like, I mean, I could play it during the red RC for hours at a time because I was grinding to get in red. But I, I like right now, like just looking at the game, it's just so depressing and bland. Why can't it be nice and colorful like Fortnite or Black Ops 2 or Black Ops 3? You know what I mean? Like, just make the colors look nice. Make the maps look nice. That's another issue. Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3. Some of the most iconic maps were on that game. But when you look at this game, yeah, yeah we got, well, we got... Gustav Cannon, which for some reason half the people hate. I don't know why. But I mean, other than that, you got US ass Texas. You got, that map is garbage. And you got London Docks. Like, oh, there you go. There's there's your map rotation for trick shotters. It's it's garbage. Like, nobody wants to play those maps over and over and over again. But yeah, at the end of the day, Treyarch is the best Call of Duty game developer that like, they, they have the best track record with Call of Duties. They technically haven't put out a bad COD. So like, I'm super excited for Treyarch to release Black Ops 4. I I know that they're gonna do a lot of things right they're one of the actual uh developers that like listen to the community i feel like there's a lot to learn from fortnite surprisingly like you know i hate pay to win i hope they don't do like buying supply drops so that you can get like cooler guns that are like better like aw was paid to oh my god don't put pay to win have nice maps and nice colors which i'm pretty sure Treyarch already has that down you know they got that locked they're gonna do that i already know and as far as the mechanics go i feel like if they have anything that's similar to black ops 2 or black ops 3 you know that engine that they got going is pretty good i like it you got the instant swaps if you go why why hey awesome if you can't oh well all in all i really hope it's gonna be a good call of duty everyone always hopes every year some people get their hopes let down other people see, genuinely enjoy the con that comes out it just depends on who you are because not every cod is for everybody there's some people that love playing world war ii and infinite warfare that it's just how it is. But yeah, other than that, I guess I'm just going to wrap it up. I'm kind of going off on like, uh, I don't even know what I'm going off on. I'm just talking about random stuff now. So yeah, hope you guys did enjoy the video. It doesn't seem like we're going to get another game started. And I don't, I don't even know. Yeah, yeah. Some, I don't know. The game's broken. See, fix your game. Keep it updated. Fix your game. Nice colors, nice camos, nice maps. Like, give us more stuff and maybe we'll play World War II more. But yeah, so it doesn't seem like we're going to get another game. I'm just going to wrap up the video right here. I'm going to show you guys a bunch of shots in this video because I've been playing this game for like the past two or three days, mostly with my boy Kenshi because he's a homie. And I swear to God, this kid hits like at least four times a day if I play a couple hours of this game with him. Like, he is a monster right there. There he is right there in the flesh. I just touched my, my monitor. Anyways, the majority of the shots that you guys are going to see in this video were actually 
actually hit by him. I got like a hit marker and a couple leftovers and some other people got some other like decently leftover cool shots. I don't know. There, there's like 11 shots or something like that. So yeah, drop a like for all these World War II trick shots. It makes sense that I'd make a video with like a lot of shots. You know, I joined off this game, even though it's not one of the best games, it still got me in red. So it's got a special place in my heart. But yeah, I'm actually going to commentate over these clips. So we're just going to actually just jump right into all the shots that we've hit. All right, guys. So jumping right into it, we're starting things off with a nice little winter Carrington wall bang for the game winner. He actually called it out too from a man, uh, Ziza. Hits a nice little 720. But you know, it's pretty sick nonetheless. Good stuff to the homie right there. Now we're going on to probably one of Kenshi's shots. So let's be honest, Kenshi has just about every single clip. I was actually AFK there, setting his spawn. It's actually my boy Hoosier coming in again. He was in the Black Ops 3 video hitting shots. Now he's here hitting shots on World War 2. Hits a nice little stair bang shot. Now this is actually my shot right here. It's a pretty bad shot though. It's a nice little leftover. It's it's really bad. Like like I'm pretty good at this game. I got it right off this game. That was a bad shot. Why did I do that again? I didn't know he was that close. Exactly. I even said it. I was like, why did I do that? I even knew he was. I didn't know he was that close. But I mean, hey, a shot's a shot. You know, nice little mini clip. Can't be too mad about it. Now my man Kenji. Look at this shot. He goes off like the side of the the hill and like wall bangs the guy into the green barn. I don't even know, dude. Kenshi just hits everything, and here's another one. Kenshi hit again. I don't even know where the guy was on this one. He uh he camps, he uh inspects, reloads, into swaps, and like crazy wall bang into like the ladder building or something. I don't even know. Guy was somewhere there. I don't I don't know what he's doing. He has he has EB. I'm very convinced he has EB, and I'm pretty sure this is also Kenshi again with some more EB. Oh no way! And he hits the London docks like reverse, not Suey, but reverse like wall bang. To the other side of the dock that was really sick now this is my shot i wouldn't even i wouldn't even consider my shots shots like like hey you know if it gets me that title 11 shots you know i'll throw it in you might as well but another just like another like really barrel stuff decent whatever shot i don't even know it wasn't even cool it was just like anything else now this is actually a hit marker i got this is actually a pretty decent hit marker would have been cool to hit. Once again, nothing insane because, you know, I'm not the insane one. Kenshi's the insane one. And I bet you this is, yep, another one of his clips. And he actually hits a stair wall bang as well to mid map, which was actually really sick. I saw the guy from my point of view. He was like down, like by the bomb almost, but like a little bit in front of it. But yeah, what other clips do we have here? I forgot to cut this clip. Oh, well, looks like I'm just going to be having to talking over it. And you guys can hear my voice while the next song plays and next clip. <laughs> Uh, this is actually like the very first day that we were playing first game on keep in mind We've been playing this game only for like a day and a half So this is all took place in like this lifespan or not the lifespan What the heck am I saying this all took place in the span of like a day and a half and now the last clip my dude Kenshi once again, of course once again He's always hitting the bangers tries to do the glitch spot But he says you know what nah the guy's perfect for the bill cam I'm just gonna smack the bill cam and you guys won't believe where the guy was you don't think that he was like coming up on top of the cannon on the stairs because he wasn't he like wall banged the trains like he wall banged like triple wall bangs like the the stair the the cannon the train the green like i don't even know and he triple wall bangs the guy behind the green train so that was insane nonetheless so be sure to check out kenshi in the description if you guys did enjoy drop a like and a comment down below and subscribe for new it's been red Wreck, and i'll catch you guys later